Okay, so um, this is a walking food machine, and uh, a lot of people buy walking food machine because they're gonna do heavy stuff, and when they do heavy stuff, they wanna do single stitching. Let's see if you're making bags, if you're making very nice, expensive stuff, right? You wanna do stitching, meaning you wanna go where you're going to stitch one at a time, all right? So that's when you have the, need, the machine with servo motor, brushless meaning you could speed down and speed up. So let's say I'm gonna come all the way down to the slowest speed, right? Uh, which is two, right? And I try. Still, this is the slowest, right? A lot of people say we want this to be one at a time. We wanna be, okay? So see, this is the highest, um, the fast jump. See, there is no more, meaning that this is slow. Now, that's when you get, now there are a lot of, maybe one or two different motors in the market that they're really expensive, about 2,000 bucks, that they could do one stitch at a time. That's when the speed reducer comes into mind. Oh my God. And they're really, really heavy. And you have to, um, you could buy this. This is made, both of them are on our website called Speed Reducer. And one of them is about 129, the other one is 189. Doesn't matter what price it is. But this goes on the bottom of your tape. Okay, screws on. And what it does is from the belt, you come to here and from here to here, and from here, you come to this right here, meaning you, you're gonna be needing two belts. Meaning that pulley, by the way, this will not work on direct drive. The one that have, the machine that have a direct drive inside here, the motor is here, it will not work. It only works on an external motor, either servo, brushless, or the, uh, the, the other motor, what is it called? The heavy duty old ones, obsolete ones. Not anymore, we don't try, use them anymore. Uh, clutch motors they call them, okay? So here, so from the speed, from the motor to here, to here, and from here to the motor, meaning it makes it very slow. This makes, it has to make many turns this one has to make many turns to make a small tiny turn here, right? They call it speed reducer. Now, it goes on the bottom. You have to buy an extra belt for it, usually size 25, 26, 27. We have both of them. The difference between these two is that this one has only uh, two speed, meaning this is uh, from here to here is, I have written them down. On this one, you have only two inch and six inch pulley. two inch and six inch pulley, all right? And this one, and it's adjustable, meaning if your belt is a little bit small or higher, you could just, if it's underneath right here, you could adjust it. And this one, wow, really heavy. It's three inch, six inch, and nine inch. Three, six, nine, let me double check. Is on our website, goldstartool.com. You want to use this on, yeah, 369. 369 inch pulley. You want to use this one on heavy duty sewing machine. You don't want to use this on a cover stitch machine. It, you know, these are for dedicated, delicate stitching, right? For height, for bag making, if you want. Otherwise, you don't have to do it. You could get away with a regular. Um, servo machine motor, but these are speed reducers. You, from one, from the motor, to a speed reducer, from a speed reducer, to the pulley right here. Three option right here, two option right here. Uh, this is David from goldstartool.com. Thank you for watching. Share, thumbs up, what else? Like, subscribe, and have a golden day. Have a golden day. Thank you so much.